Welcome to Robonic. In this video, I will show you how to block bad websites on PC and block bad apps and websites on Android phone. On phone, we have bad websites and apps too. In the first part, we will see how to block bad websites on PC. If you only want to check how to block bad apps and websites on Android phone, then you can directly skip to that part. To block bad websites on PC in Chrome browser, you have to install a Chrome extension and name of that extension is block site. So you have to search block site extension. This is the extension. I'm going to install this extension. So we have to click on add to Chrome. Now this extension has been installed on our Chrome browser. Now we have to accept the privacy policy. They have paid plans too, but we are not going to use the paid one. So skip this. First check out how we can block this website here. So I'm going to choose block site and click on block this site. Now this site has been blocked. And if we want to check more, we will click on this gear icon. Now here, you can also enter the website address you want to block. See, we have blocked this website. And when we will click on the refresh, this site will not be displayed. So this site is blocked by block site. Not only this, you can also block the websites with the words. Like if you want to block any site with the porn word in that. So you have to simply add the word. Now we are going to add this item and when we will search this term on our computer, we will be getting this error. So we can simply block the websites and we can also block the websites by the keywords or words. There are more options which you can use with the paid plan. If you don't want to show this message on the screen, then you can redirect this to any other website for that you have to click on this redirect button and just enter the address now we have added google.com now see if we are going to search this term we will be redirected to google.com so this is the best way to block any website without telling that we are blocking the website. There are too many options in this and you can use with their paid plan. Now let's move to the mobile and see how we can block apps and websites on Android phone. First, let's check how to block bad apps which are not suitable for children. To do that, we will use Google Play Store restriction so that children could not download apps or games which are not suitable for their age. To block apps, we have to go to Play Store. Here, click on your profile photo. Now go to Settings. Now here, click on Family tab. Now Parental Control are turned on. See, if they are off in your phone, you have to turn them on and you have to enter any pin so i'm going to enter a pin and turn this parental control on here you can also set the restriction based on the ages so 3 plus most restrictive and you can also set it for 7 plus 12 plus 16 plus and 18 plus so i'm going to save it with 3 plus now let's see how this parental control work now there is a popular app, the baby in yellow. I'm going to search this app. See, this app is not suitable for children of three plus age. And it is showing the error parental control restrict downloading of this app. In this way, you can stop your kids from downloading these kind of apps or games. Now see how to stop them from accessing bad websites. One way to do that is using Google Chrome's inbuilt feature. Yet it is not sure short way, but it will save kids from unwanted results. 
To do that, open your Google Chrome browser. Click on these three dots. Go to Settings and go to Privacy and Security. And here you have to check that your Safe Browsing Enhanced Protection is turned on or not. When you will turn this on, go back, click on these three lines and here safe search is off. You have to click on this and turn it on. Now this will not show any explicit content like violence or any other results which are not suitable. As I told you, this is not the sure shot way to stop these kind of results. So there is one another way. For that, we have to install a third party app. And in this video, I'm going to use the same app we use on our PC. And the name of that app is Block Site. So I'm going to install this. When this app is installed, go to this app, accept their privacy policy. So here they will ask for accessibility permission to block requested apps and sites so you have to click on agree i'm going to click on installed apps and block site is the app so we have to allow it and then again we have to agree about the uses now here block site is turned on you have to enable this now it's asking for their paid version, but we are not going to use it. So I'm going to close this. Now we have installed block site successfully and to add the apps and websites, we have to click on this plus icon. So here you can add the apps installed on your mobile and the websites which you want to block. Suppose I want to block Instagram. So I will click on this and suppose I want to block Facebook then I'm going to add this to the list you can also add the keyword app or site here so let's check out whether it's blocking Facebook and Instagram so now I'm going to check the Instagram app now I'm trying to access the Facebook in Chrome browser See the Facebook is also blocked by block site. So in this way, you can block your apps and websites using this block site app. There are some other apps for parental control, which are Kaspersky parental control, kids logs, trend micro antivirus, which you can use to block apps and websites, which you don't want your children watch. Don't forget to share this video with your friends. And if you like this video, please hit the like button.